Within every department, there exist certain individuals who are cut above the rest. Real gems who display pure brilliance in everything they do. In an ever-changing and often uncertain world, it's their passion, drive, and commitment that inspires and unifies those around them. These polished employees push beyond boundaries and show respect, accountability, and integrity in everything they do. They truly embody the values of Old Mutual and make it possible for us all to do great things. Tonight, we let these gems shine in all their brilliance by celebrating and recognizing their achievements. Welcome to the Old Mutual Corporate Excellence Awards 2012. Before we reveal this year's finalists, let's find out just what it takes to be nominated for an Old Mutual Corporate Excellence Award. And who better to ask than the winners of the Old Mutual Corporate Excellence Awards 2011? We caught up with Soshin Subramani, winner of the People Development Star Award. Anil Maharaj, leading Sales Star Award winner. Saras Pakiri, Business Support Star Award winner. Hugh Hacking, winner of the Innovation Star Award. And Neville Hyde, winner of the Business Support Star Award. And we asked them to share some of their experiences with us. It made me feel really proud of my achievements in, uh, in, you know, in the past year and also really proud of Old Mutual. It really shows recognition of the company for the, the work that I've done in the past. There's a much bigger picture at play here and that you are but a cog in a, in a very efficient, bigger wheel. Winning is truly an honour and also it speaks of success. It has instilled in me a greater sense of loyalty for an organisation like Old Mutual that values its people. Winning the award has enhanced my uh, sense of being an ambassador to Old Mutual. My approach towards my customers and my team has changed in that it has increased by a greater level. I want to win again of course and go on another lovely trip and so now I work harder and I work faster and try to do the things that I need to do to get nominated again. The big difference in, for me in, in winning the award is, is becoming aware of, of the greater team and the fact that by putting together as a team it actually makes a difference for the business, uh, for our clients, for our members and ultimately for you as a participant in that process. I have a desire to do more than is expected of me. It was a really great feeling and made me feel really good about Old Mutual. It has motivated me to work harder and try to achieve again and again. The value that stands out as a result of the Excellence Awards is ironically enough teamwork. It raises the bar for people. Uh, it gives people something as to aspire to. They help to recognize people that really add value to the business. The organization is the sum of its parts. The people make the organization what it is and are valued. The Excellence Award adds great amount of value to Old Mutual as a company in ensuring that their staff is recognized for their commitment and dedication. It's through teamwork that we, we can each have the opportunity to shine, but that you're still dependent ultimately on everybody around you. In general, just foster this culture of innovation and competitiveness and ambition. It really sets apart those people and, and gives them something extra to look forward to and as some achievement recognition. Advice for colleagues, work hard enough, do the right thing so that you can go on a, one of these trips, they are absolutely fantastic. Each person needs to believe in themselves. Be and do your best, all times. People generally have so much potential and uh, I think people are generally just not aware of that full potential. You need to win this award to know what it's all about. It'll take your breath away, go for it. If we contribute to the success of our mutual, you will be rewarded. If each one of us brings out that full potential, then Old Mutual will just do such amazing things.
Brazil was an excellent venue. It was a trip that I'll never forget. It was awesome. The day we arrived, we, I had my first sort of uh, first surfing lesson on Ipanema Beach. For me, one of the highlights of going to Rio was, was the opportunity to surf off the Copacabana. To me, the highlight was really immersing myself in, in the Brazilian culture and seeing how Brazil operates. It was absolutely amazing. A mutual corporate went out of its way to spoil us on every step of the journey. My husband and I, together with the group, thoroughly enjoyed ourselves. On a broader level, it was the opportunity to engage with, with colleagues who you don't necessarily talk to on a daily basis and with their spouses and, and get to see the other side of people. The drive on the beach buggy to Buzios was a, such a thrilling experience. Around every corner there was a surprise waiting for us. One of the highlights was Copacabana Beach and spending the success with my wife. The people that were with us just made the trip so memorable by giving us such top quality service. One of the specific highlights was climbing the Sugarloaf Mountain. My wife Jessica was extremely nervous but we got to the top, it was great fun. I would like to congratulate All Mutual Corporate on uh, having an award that I think you know, the rest of the business can really be jealous of. One of the real highlights actually was to have Uncle Marshall on the trip. It was so special to have him and his lovely wife there and, and the commitment that it shows of Old Mutual was just impressive. And now it's time to find out who's a cut above the rest, who rocks your department, and who always delivers a polished performance. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for the Old Mutual Corporate Excellence Awards 2012 finalists. Congratulations to Shireen Peterson, John Mackay, Nicole McCullum, Felicity Stierman, Sugita Naidu and Ridwan Waki, Robambo Krokwana, Vusi Kumalo, Juan Duprea, Tanya Risik, Ingrid Kubai, Penny Umplaby, Graham Stevens, Phil Toland, Charmaine Jacobs, Amanda Lowe, Carol Sihani, Philomena Badenhorst, Annaline Hrunewald, Mandy Harker, Mark Anderson, Nikki Holzhausen, Anil Maharaj, Tanya Rousseau, and the Isasa team, Elzet Ursthazen, Wuthe Minno, Eugenia Musomi, Tembi Mavuso, Philomena Badenhorst, and Tagane Sitabi Mushonga.